students gathering outside Olive Elementary School in Novato Tuesday morning have no idea why they're being taken out of class. Hi, fourth graders. How are you? Good. Or what's in store for them later this week. Surprise! You guys are going on your field trip. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why do my ears hurt? Up until this point, the fourth graders' planned visit to the SF MoMA, their first field trip in three years, was canceled because of a nationwide school bus driver shortage. I like wanted to go like really badly. To hear that it was canceled, I got so bummed. I couldn't get a bus for these kids. For a month? Yes, at least, yes. Two previous trips also had to be canceled at the last minute, too. I started crying. I was at work, and I was shaking, and I was crying, mostly because I didn't want another disappointment for these kids. That's when parent Anne-Marie Costa reached out to ABC7. When we made some calls, Gary Bauer of Bauer Transportation had a personal reason to give back. I'm actually born and raised in Nevada, and I have an eight-year-old myself, so at the end of the day, I realize how much is important these events, and these off-sites, and these field trips are for these kids. His company has been in operation for more than 30 years, but never offered school bus service. But when routes across the Bay Area were cut during the pandemic and it started affecting kids, they added to their fleet. It's a tough market out right there, and it's, some of these companies are really stretched, so we wanted to be there and do our part that we get to make put smiles on these kids' faces. As for these resilient students who have been through so much already, learning virtually for two years during the pandemic, it's the little things that matter. I kind of look forward to going on the bus. <laughs> it's kind of fun to it talk to friends on the bus. This is my first field trip in three years, so oh I'm just so excited. The students leave for the SF MoMA on Thursday. I just want to say thank you because this is really big for us. Yeah. We have never had anything really like this before, so it's really exciting. Thank you. <laughs> You guys, a lot for doing this. Thank you, Pastor In Nevada, Dion Lim, ABC7 News.